Adventures. I'm getting ready to do a spirit box session in the case of Casey White and Vicki White. She's the correction officer from Lauderdale, Florida that helped the felon convict Casey White escape about two weeks ago from the prison. Now, he was in prison facing 75 years for the killing of Connie Ridgeway, which he confessed to. Now, she was stabbed in her home. She's 58 years old. And his ex-girlfriend, Christy Shelton, who was found died of a self-inflicted gunshot wound. So they have reopened her case to see if maybe he had some involvement in that since he was in the house when it happened. So I have the Gotcha Go Spirit Box set up with the S Box. I have the Spirit Talker app on my phone. So it's a dictionary, so words kind of come through. And the S Box just kind of scans FM frequencies and then this kind of amplifies it so it picks up words through that. And then I have the Boo Buddy Jr. set up and he's a little EMF meter so if any energy comes near him his little paws will light up. And then I have some incense burning. Iron Age. It says Iron Age. And I have their picture set up. So I'm going to go ahead and ask some questions and see if I can get Connie or Christy to come through on the spirit box. So let's see what we can find out. I'm asking if just the spirits of Connie Ridgeway and Christy Shelton can come forward tonight and speak to me. If you're here tonight, will you say your name for me loud and clear? If you want to hear. <laughs> So Connie, um, I'm asking if you can give me any recollection Auntie. of the last thing you remember that night. It says Auntie. Like 2020. So, Connie, can you communicate through this spirit box and tell me what happened to you that night? I know Casey White was responsible for your murder because he did confess. But can you tell me the last thing you remember that night? This is attachment. <laughs> Outside. It sounded like slashed something. It's someone else. It says it's someone else. So Christy, I heard that you were a really good mom. Do you have any messages for your children or family? Christy, can you tell me, was Casey White responsible for what happened to you? I heard an answer right away. I'm not sure what it said. Can you repeat what you said loud and clear? And what do you think? 
think about Vicky White helping him escape? I also have these little kitty balls that you can light up if you move them the light. There's one there and there's one here. Do you have any messages for your family or friends? Said miss your voice. What do you think will happen to Casey White now that he's been rearrested? Will he get the death penalty? Most likely in the morning. In the morning. It says whole. Do you have any messages for Casey White about what he did to you? Uh -huh. Sound, I heard like mortar and solder or something. Meeting. Can you tell me where you are now, Connie? Are you still around your boys? I love you. We will touch you. You can touch me if you want. Go ahead. Can you say my name? What will happen to Vicki White now? She's in the hospital of a self-inflicted gunshot wound, allegedly. Gary. Says Gary. Who's Gary? So, Christy Shelton, can you give me any more information about what happened to you when you passed away? What's the last thing you remember? Sounded like drywall. If it was self-inflicted, can you say it was self-inflicted? It was conjured. It was conjured. Do you think Casey White is evil? Yes. Is he possessed by a demon? Three times. Understand Is Vicki White going to survive her gunshot wound? The truth is something. Can you tell me where Vicky shot herself? I, th I heard point something. Okay. 
we need help. Are you stuck somewhere? Where are you now? Angel. Angel. Are you an angel in heaven now? It's acceptable or something. Connie, do you have any messages for Casey White? Go back. He's going to go back to prison. He like, stay in prison. Will he get the death penalty Bad now? Bad spirits here. Bad spirits here. Will Casey White get the death penalty now? What's wrong with him? Why is he so evil to everybody? Is it a mental issue? Cross. It says cross. What will happen to Vicky White now? Blood. blood. What do you mean by blood? Do you have any other messages about what happened to you? Several something 59. Set. Connie, are you around your boys? Are you watching over them? Yeah, sort of. Try to get to them. Christy, are you around your children? Uh, it says I'm hiding. Our secret. About what? About the case, about what's going to happen. Albert. This is Albert. Who's Albert? Can you tell me anything else about Casey White? What? Please move forward. Please move forward. I'm wondering if Casey White's brother can come forward. I heard that he's been missing for about four years. Are you here with us tonight? Can you come forward and say your name? Because I don't know your name, but can you come forward and say it, please? Protection. Protection. Can the spirit of Casey White's brother come forward and tell me where you are? The other side. Francis. Francis. Can you do anything else to show me you're here? Can you light up one of these kitty balls for me? 
evidence. What evidence can you give us that will help the case against Casey? <laughs> So I'm asking if the spirit of Vicki White will come forward and talk to me today. Vicki, can you say your name loud and clear for me so I can hear it through this device? Vicky, can you tell me what the last thing is that you remember yesterday? What happened to you? Like where? It sounded like I quit. Scottish. It says Scottish. So I got the news last night that you passed away. Can you tell me what happened to you? Beatrice. It says Beatrice. Who's Beatrice? So Vicky, can you tell me, were you in love with Casey White? I think it was, I heard maybe. Do you think that he conned you into helping him escape? <laughs> I heard, I don't think so. Did you have a long-term relationship with Casey over a couple years? Don't antagonize. It says don't antagonize. I'm not antagonizing, I'm just trying to find out the truth of what happened. You seem like such a good employee for a long time. You threw away your retirement and you sold your house for less than value. Why did you do that? Casey loved you? I think I heard he did. Blind. It says blind. You heard a lot of people doing what you did. What about your family and your friends and your co-workers? Did you think about how they would feel about what you did? <laughs> Door. Says door. Did you plan this escape for a long time? We're all good. We're all good.
Are you unhappy here? Why did you end it the way you did? You probably would have just done some time and they would have considered your work history and you would have got out. Why did you do what you did? Sacred ground. It says sacred ground. Why did you throw away your retirement and everything for KC? Why did you do that? <laughs> Are you with your late husband on the other side? Yes. Were you already seeing Casey when you were still married? Pretty picture. Edmund. It says Edmund. Who's Edmund? Do you have anything to say to Casey Way? <laughs> Are we friends? It says, are we friends? Did you think that if you just bought different wigs and had a fake ID that you just wouldn't get spotted in the area? Is that why you were still only a few hours away? <laughs> Do you ha did you have a plan of where you were going to go? Was there actually a place in plan? Permission. Permission. Do you have any messages for your family or friends? Ask one more time, were you in love with Casey uh, White or were you bribed by him and conned? <laughs> So Vicky, can you tell me where you are now? Is there a heaven? I thought I heard memorial for people. Vicky, do you have anything to say before I go? Do you have anything to say to Connie or Christy? Fond memories here. Fond memories here?
Is that what you have to say? You had fun memories here? <laughs> Are you with Connie and Christy on the other side? Do you know who they are? It sounded like, I know. Why did you have all those guns in your car? <laughs> Were you going to shoot your way out like Bonnie and Clyde? Was that the plan to just have a shootout? <laughs> Can you light up one of these balls here? There's one here by this candle. There's one right here. If you just touch them, they'll light up. Are you able to move things and light things up? Can you light this little bear up before, before I go? His little paws will light up if you get near him. Can you do that? Do you have anything else to say for yourself? Can you tell us why you did what you did? I kind of said to protect. Mommy. Do you have anything else to say before I go? You did cause some damage. You hurt a lot of people. Do you have anything to say about that? Were you just going to keep switching cars? Permission. Permission? Were you going to keep switching cars and driving around and just keep doing what you were doing? Was that the plan? To wear wigs and disguise yourselves? I heard kill. Well, thank you for talking to me. Goodbye, and I hope you rest in peace. Well, that concludes this Spirit Box session in the case of Vicki White, Connie Ridgway, and Christy Shelton. I hope you enjoyed the video, and if you can, please remember to subscribe. Hit the thumbs up if you enjoyed the video. Hit the notification bell so you get notified for more videos. And remember, you can become Patreon members, YouTube members, and you get all kinds of perks, free spirit box sessions, and all kinds of bonus stuff. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you soon. Take care. Bye.